good idea. We in the middle, yeah. behind yeah. you, and then right there, up the on middle. the table, right here by the table. I have to be surrounded by the right things. Now, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Loud. Every few years, as summertime nears, an announcement arrives in the mail. A reunion is planned. It'll really be grand. Make plans to attend without fail. I'll never forget the first time we met. We tried so hard to impress. We drove fancy cars and smoked big cigars and wore our most elegant dress. And my cigar kept getting bad, and you know, and his dress was like, kept riding up. And it was quite an affair. The whole class was there. It was held at a fancy hotel. We whined and we dined and we acted refined and everyone thought it was swell. The men all conversed about who had been first to achieve great fortune and fame. Meanwhile, their spouses described their fine houses and how beautiful their children became. <laughs> the homecoming queen, who had once been lean, now weighed 196. <laughs> the jocks who were there had all lost their hair and the cheerleaders could do no more kicks. <laughs> no one had heard about the class nerd who'd guided a spacecraft to the moon. Or poor little Jane who'd always been plain, she meant to be a shipping tycoon. <laughs> the boy we've decreed most apt to succeed was serving 10 years in the pen. Oh. <laughs> Well, the one voted least is now was a priest. It shows you how wrong, how you can be wrong now and then. <laughs> i got to put my glasses on so I can read this. Is that right? Is that right? That's right. They awarded a prize to one of the guys who seemed to have aged the least. Another was given to the grad who had driven the farthest to attend the feast. They took a class picture, a curious mixture of beehives, crew cuts, and wide ties. <laughs> Tall, short, or skinny, the style was the many you never saw so many thighs. <laughs> At our next get-together, no one cared whether they impressed his classmates or not. The mood was informal, a whole lot more normal, but this time, we'd all gone to pot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was held out of doors at the lake shores. We ate hamburgers, coleslaw, and beans. Then most of us lay around in the shade in our comfortable t-shirts and jeans. By the 50th year, it was abundantly clear. We were definitely over the hill. Those who weren't dead had to crawl out of bed and be home in time for their pill. <laughs> <laughs> and now I can't wait. They've just set the date. Our 71st is coming. I'm told it should be a ball. They've rented a hall at the shady rest home for the old. <laughs> <laughs> Repairs have been made on my hearing aid. Let me what? see. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> my paste baker's been turned up on high. My wheelchair is oiled. My teeth have been boiled. And I've bought a new wig and a glass eye. <laughs> I'm feeling quite hearty. I'm ready to party. I'll dance till the dawn's early light. It'll be lots of fun. I just hope there's one other person who gets there that night. Oh, <laughs> nice. Did you write that? No, I found it. Oh, author, author. Uh, she said she found uh, it. Thank you. Wow.